Tommy Douglas is truly one of the greatest Canadians who ever lived because of his contributions that helped shape our nation for the better. Douglas's major accomplishment that helps us even today is his Medicare initiative. Even though he was fought against by other political parties and even doctors, he kept his eye on his vision of free healthcare. He believed that everyone should receive the same quality of healthcare no matter what financial status, and this belief became a reality. In 1962, Tommy Douglas and his political party, CCF, managed to get Saskatchewan to adopt the Medicare plan, covering every person in Saskatchewan with prepaid, publicly administered health care. As we can see now, this health care system eventually expanded through all of Canada. Tommy Doug Douglas deserves a Heritage Minutes video to educate the citizens of Canada of his accomplishments and how it impacts them today. Osteomyelitis in your right leg. So will I lose my leg? Tommy's family was not wealthy and could not pay for an immediate treatment. It nearly cost Tommy his right leg. This experience began Tommy's quest for universal public health care. I believe that everyone should have an equal amount of care when it comes to their health. They should have the chance to get help if they are ill. This Medicare plan gives them that chance and provides everyone in Saskatchewan with prepaid publicly administered health care. Douglas's political opponents and Saskatchewan doctors opposed his Medicare plan. In 1960, the CCF fell into hard times and was abolished. Although in 1961, out of the ashes of CCF, the new Democratic Party was born, with Tommy Douglas as its leader. In 1962, Saskatchewan adopts the Medicare plan and Tommy Douglas remains in politics until 1979, when he retires. Thanks to Tommy Douglas, the citizens of Canada have not to worry of their health. After 42 years in politics, Douglas has shown that he is a remarkable Canadian and his efforts are still rewarding us today.